Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And in this video today, we're going to talk about how to attract men who are on the same energetic and emotional level as you. Uh, but before we talk about that, if you're struggling to attract the right man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website and take my quiz. Um, so today's question comes from a woman in our community, and she's asking, how do I attract men who are on the same energetic and emotional level as I am? And so, uh, you know, this is kind of a um, trick question here in some ways, because you always attract men who are on the same energetic level as you are. Um, if you're having a problem with the energetic level of men that you're dating, um, you may want to reconsider what energetic level you're on. Um, you know, it's it's always interesting to me because everybody thinks that they're on a higher energetic level than, you know, the opposite sex. And, uh, you know, women always are like, oh, you know, I'm trying to find evolved, you know, mature men, you know, and men are like, oh, I'm trying to find, you know, evolve mature women and and uh you know when when i was coaching men it was the, every everybody thinks that the opposite sex is is uh less put together than they are and so um uh yeah you know you might want to reconsider what energetic level you're on right now and and uh, figure out how to raise your vibrational level and um you know you may end up attracting men that aren't quite up there yet but um uh, if you're, you know, at that level and you're coming from um, a space of being on a high vibrational frequency and you're, you know, going out to where uh, other types of men like, you know, other types of people like that, especially men, are going to be, then you're going to attract one of those guys. And if you're not, um, you may want to rethink you being on an, a higher energetic level than they are. Um, and as far as an emotional level is concerned, uh, you're unlikely to attract a man who's on the same emotional level as you are. Uh, you know, I, I hear that from women a lot, like, where are all these, you know, super emotionally mature men? You know, and, and really, um, most of them don't exist, and a lot of the guys that are kind of on that higher emotional level um, are, uh, you know, kind of feminine type of guys um and and you know once in a while you'll have a really mature emotionally you know put together guy but um uh you know he's he's probably never going to be on the same emotional level that you're on um it, it's like trying to find a, a man trying to f attract a woman who's as rational as he is you know I, i've met women that are rational like that but uh most of them i wouldn't want to date and so um yeah, you know, it's not that you're not going to attract a guy like that. It's that you're probably not going to want to date a guy who's like that because he's not going to be very attractive to you. So if you can find an, a guy who's incredibly emotionally aware and masculine at the same time, um, you know, hopefully you're on those levels as well uh, so that you can attract him. And, and if I were you, that's what I'd focus on. And I would focus on going out to places where mature masculine men would be. Um, and there's, you know, groups and, you know, communities, especially personal growth communities. A lot of, uh, guys will go out to, and be a part of those types of things. But, you know, you, you can find guys all over the place that, you know, it's, I get women all the time that are like, where do I find the right guy? And it's like, you know, they're, the right guys are everywhere and the right guys are nowhere. And, you know, it, it there's no one magical place that you can go. So um, that's it for this video. If you're, if you are, uh, if you'd like more information on what's stopping you from attracting Mr. Right into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take my quiz. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.